LTE stands for Long-Term Evolution. It provides the fastest mobile broadband services commercially available today. The high speeds are made possible by using more radio spectrum per connection, multiple antenna pads, and more efficient encoding of the data being sent and received. In order to build an LTE network, some elements are required, such as antennas and radio base stations called E-Node B, a transport network including microwave links, optical fibers, and IP routers, a connection to the internet and IP networks known as the gateway, a controller to manage mobility called a mobility management entity, a home subscriber server database which contains information about all the individual subscriptions, a policy management system to ensure that the services you subscribe to are delivered accordingly, and an IP multimedia subsystem to handle voice over LTE and other multimedia services. Everything starts from your personal device. Here we go. Let's say you're making a voice over LTE phone call while you're sharing video and sending heavy emails at the same time. Boy, are you busy. The mobility management entity establishes the connections and controls the signaling with the terminal. Using LTE, all your data is sent and received in IP packets. IP packets are like boxes in which your movies, music, emails, and phone calls are going to travel. The beginning of a technological journey that will take your data from your phone, carefully sorted out in their packets, to an E-Node B radio base station. Then, a huge transport network made of microwave links, fiber, and IP routers sends your data from the antennas and E-Node B radio base stations to the gateway, a system made out of several levels. The serving gateway routes and pushes your data packet forward on its journey. It's the frontier of the packet core, maintaining the connection between your phone and the IP network while you're moving freely around. Now receiving the packets, the Packet Data Network Gateway looks at the destination of those packets, then sorts and sends your data onto the right tracks. It is the crossroad of every kind of traffic, no matter what the source of the technology. While all this data is processed, the policy management counts your data packets and applies policy rules from your personal subscription plan. Quite a bit of travel, huh? And it has yet to go to its final destination through the internet and other IP networks. And here we are, safely arrived to its destination. How easy was that? Considering the numerous benefits that you will feel using LTE networks. Improved browsing and online experience thanks to lower latency and no unwanted delays. Better app coverage, that is, better performance of multimedia applications through higher upload and download speeds. Enhanced voice communication with higher voice quality and shorter call establishment time. Naturally, LTE is also compatible with the existing telecom infrastructure and ecosystem. So, are you ready to join the journey?